we like the variability in the product because we can use the on mode and the staff can use the on mode especially on bad traffic days when they're coming back from the hospital in Goshen we have one main thoroughfare in town and it's the only way to get back and forth through town and as the economy is is today um, it often takes one of our ambulances a half hour or more just to get back in their service area so we can use the on mode selectively and the staff can uh, um, get back to their service area in a uh, faster time frame. One, one of the things that we really liked about the collision control product was just the affordability. Um, with the screen in the vehicle and the staff being able to visually see the capture um, of the preemption, we didn't have to put in uh, confirmation lights, which is an added cost and an added maintenance fee from year to year. So that cut our cost dramatically. With regard to our response times, I believe that we've had, um, probably anecdotally, we, we don't have a scientific study on our, our uh, times yet as far as data goes, but anecdotally, I believe I've noticed when we do month re monthly reports that our response times have gotten better. Uh, the system allows us to work through traffic um, at a sustained pace and, instead of having to stop, especially when we catch the green in our direction of travel, and that can only uh, do uh, they can do anything, if it does anything, it improves our ability to respond faster. As, as I talk to other chiefs about the affordability of traffic preemption, um, we were paying for this out of our budget. We couldn't afford to wait for a grant, and we had at the time several road projects going on in town that we really felt it important to get the product installed, get it up and running and get it going, and, and we simply couldn't afford, again, to the, the expense from my experience in talking with other chiefs that have done it. Um, the collision control product came in at what I felt was a great price and came in at um, easily a third to half the price of, of uh, what other chiefs had discussed with me um, with regard to their experience with preemption. So for those that are fire chiefs or, or traffic control people or bosses that make decisions for projects in a department, you never get 100% buy-in. And, and I had a couple staff members who thought, frankly, the chief was a little crazy. And um, it's interesting, a, a year later, our city council asked how the project was going. And I related, I, I had a, uh, one of our lieutenants who was at another station where there's no preemption. Uh, he came to me and he said, you know, Chief, he said, uh, I didn't necessarily care for, for this uh, project, but he said, I have to tell you that uh, I really, really like the preemption. It helps us out dramatically. And he said, I would really like to see it put in, in our territory, in our response area in town. One of the items I like in the collision control product is some of the redundancy in the product, the, the example being when we pull up at a scene, um, the uh, preemption goes off either with setting the brake and or with opening the door. So we have a couple different redundancies to make sure that it goes off while we're at a scene and we're not continuing to uh, preempt the light, um, disrupting traffic. Our future plans uh, right now, we are gaining input from our other station officers um, as, as they respond and we are already uh, accumulating a list of future intersections where we are going to apply collision control as our uh, preemption unit uh, at the intersection um, to help us, as, especially at like angled intersections or intersections that just really ha have um, odd characteristics to it. And, and it ends up making us a safer department in our travel throughout the city. One of the things I've liked about collision control and working with them, they're very receptive to our input and, and consequently getting back to us with a solution. So we have a fire station that's 150 feet from an intersection and there ends up being um, a stoplight on either side of this firehouse. Um, what collision control did for us, did some programming and on the screen, uh, the firefighters can use the touch screen and activate the preemption coming out the door without causing a problem um, at the other intersection for, for being as close as they are. So they can selectively preempt which way they go when they come out of the station.